Hi, this is Kuvi and Cal. Having some trouble making videos. My voice isn't being recorded. Let's see if this works, but um right now I want to talk about an article I read in um the local alternative uh newspaper, a little preview newspaper called the uh the Syracuse New Times. And uh the article had to deal with um, um, the richest person in Syracuse. Uh, his name is Robert Conjo, who, who built this like this big mall in our area called Carousel Mall. And he got um he got an extension put on onto the mall that he built uh, for the mall, and um, he got a tax break by this from the state for fifty four million million dollars. The tax credit and um the uh the tone of the article uh, appeared to be one of like condemn condemnation for uh for for this like um this law and and uh for for what occurred but um yeah, um this is a this is an alternative paper and it's and it's uh, um far left. I would say far left. You you have to understand people on the far left. Right? And whoever wrote the article, this is fifty fifty four million dollars that has not left the Syracuse area. It's it, it has remained in the Syracuse area. It has not gone to Albany where politicians could just squander it away on on, on, on other areas. You know. It's it, it, 54 million dollars that has remained in the local area. Now, I think that person is a positive thing. He can take that 54 million and do positive things with it, such as decrease our unemployment rate, create more jobs, more opportunities. For people. <laughs> uh, I think uh, I think you really should understand these 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 most basic of, of concepts here. Uh, people on the left. Okay. Have a nice day.